ladies and gentlemen, you see what's going on with my man, Leangelo Ball, G3, G Hancho. Listen, homage will be paid. Do you see this man? Now, I want everybody to understand something very clear. This man, G3, was dealing with a lot of injuries that derailed his situation. We, we ain't got to get all into it, but we all know what's going on. I'm here to tell you right now, he is back training with the CEO of Big Ball LeBrand, his father, LeVon Ball himself. And I'm telling you, only greatness, you know, is in store for LeAngelo Ball. This is a very great sighting, you know, that Jello is back in the gym. Jello is back getting active and getting it, getting his situation back to getting on the floor. You know, um, Injuries is just something that we can't predict. This has been a tough year, you know, for all the Ball brothers. But definitely, I want to highlight G3. Make sure you subscribe to Flight Sports for more Triple B content, more LiAngelo Ball news updates, and more. Now, listen. Now, LeVon Ball posted this to his social media. You know, uh, Jello is out here lifting like, uh, I mean, seriously. Clearly, you see some much more definition, you know, um, in his body frame. You know, clearly he is elevating his body mass in terms of his strength. We all knew that Jello is the stronger, stronger one out of Lonzo and obviously Lamelo. We all know that um, Jello clearly has, you know, post potential if he was to exploit that. We all know that he's known for being the shooter, you know, and things of that nature, you know. But Jello can do multiple things on the floor, and I can't wait till he can get that opportunity. But he must get healthy, and that's what I like. That Lavar Ball is getting a plan in place. We all know, and Lavar Ball has. Been made it clear. He told the Chicago Bulls, you need to bring Lonzo to him. Let him do it. You understand? And you see what he's doing for LiAngelo Ball. It won't be long before we hear the news that Jello is in a situation, you know, whether it's in the U.S., but possibly overseas. LeVon Ball is already on the record of stating that there is interest overseas. We heard the New Zealand breakers, you know, general manager, I believe his name is Simon, pardon me. He came out and expressed interest in LiAngelo Ball. So clearly is a destination overseas for Jello. You know, um, LeVon Ball, shout out to LeVon Ball, big triple B's is in the building. This guy, LeVon, was all in the news, you know, uh, for um, basically, if, if you've been living under a rock, LeVon Ball has came out and basically is popping off with the triple B brand. You know, he's came out and um, he, dropped, he dropped a new line of shoes that basically, you know, is his own standalone, but is similar to, you know, um, with some of the Yeezys, with the, what people wear with the Yeezys, you know. So I don't understand why, you know, you know, critics going to say whatever they want to say is unconventional, you know. Um, while the things that Triple Bs do is sometimes is unconventional to people who, you know, just want to just critique the Triple Bs. But clearly, you know, through all of that, Big Baller Brand is still standing, thriving, and pushing and moving forward. And I think that's something that the media do not express enough. And here in Flight Sports, we're going to be the ones to do it. Well, hell, I will. You understand? Shout out everybody rocking with Flight Sports TV, pushing the Big Baller Brand forward. We all know what's going on. Um, but LeVar Ball took over the internet again like he always does, you know, and I like what he's done. You know, he's obviously giving it all to his children, you know, mellow. Let's not even get started. That's irrelevant. Lonzo, when he's healthy, that's irrelevant. You know, Jello clearly, you know, it was a plan in place where they was working with, you know, Bone Collector. You know, obviously we've seen the situation, you know, with the Hornets, uh, the G League. Let's not even get me started. You know, I don't want to beat on a dead horse. Obviously, we didn't like the situation because when you start to think about it, that's why I think overseas is the move for Jello. Because um, I don't see, uh, especially with the Charlotte Hornets, clearly he said in his interview with BET with his um, girlfriend, Nikki Baby, he stated that basically, he listen, he didn't, wasn't getting what he wanted and he had to get up out of there. And I like that he came out and said that. Didn't just go the traditional route and said to something that, no, just say what exactly happened. You know, he wasn't getting the playing time he thought he deserved and he needed to get 
up out of there. You cannot continue to be somewhere where you're getting devalued. And that's what was going on with the Charlotte Hornets G League team. You know, they was definitely devaluing, trying to, you know, uh, but it was to no avail. You know, Jello is um, going to pop off and do his thing. And um, just getting stronger is important. We all know where the game is going. Players are bigger, stronger, faster. You know, Jello clearly worked on a lot of different parts of his game a season ago. But obviously, he did, wasn't always able to get that opportunity to display it because clearly the Charlotte Hornets G League, they wanted him in a certain box. You know, um, and it seemed like they didn't want him to get up out that box. And the minutes was erratic. One minute he's starting, one minute he's playing starters minutes, one minute he don't even get off the bench. I mean, and it was really the only player who was dealing with that. So it started to make me feel like what was going on? Was this something coming from upstairs? I mean, what, what was happening? You know, because it made absolutely no sense. You know, um, but shout out to uh, LeVar Ball, you know, getting Jello active. We know he going to do that regardless. You know, and Jello trust what's going on with LeVar, that he has the plan in place. And that's what I love. You know, anytime you hear any of them speak, whether it's Lonzo, the oldest, obviously Melo, um, just just accomplishment after accomplishment in his young career, you know, um, Melo, they don't, they don't wait a chance to acknowledge LeVar Ball to let it be known that, hey, listen, my pops, my pops. And I think that's something special that they need to continue to do as well. And like I said, they're just going to continue to approve haters, doubters, you know, that people don't want to just, just get crazy, you know, but it is what it is at the end of the day. Uh, Jello is going to do something special on the basketball floor. Once again, I know a lot of people was, you know, waiting for some basketball news. Clearly, we don't have a destination just yet, but I think we are closer than ever to getting that news that we all want. We all are waiting to call that Jello is going here. At this point, we just want to hear something. And I think that LeVar Ball is getting the wheels in motion for that news to eventually break. And here at Flight Sports, we're going to break it as soon as it happens. So make sure you stay tuned. Hit the like button. Hit the bell on the icon. We're bringing an array of basketball content, sports content. You already know what it is. Shout out to everybody rocking with the Triple Bs. You already know, man. It's just it's so much, so special of all the things that they got going on. You know, and Jello is going to be activated. You know, um, I think this is something special, man. This is going to be another year of Big Ball of Brand running wild, and nothing, nobody's going to be able to do about it. Only they're going to be able to document it and pay homage. It's Flight Sports TV. Shout out to the Triple B. Shout out LeVar G3G Honcho. You already know Jello is back in the gym. Was good.